Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Tillamook ice creams. These are ones that we do not get in our area. Central Kentucky, Weird. we don't get these. Uh, we found these, they were $5.99 each at Jungle Gems International Market, price, which is in Ohio, but we had to go to Ohio to get them because uh, we, we've never seen them here. Mm. So this is the Marion Berry Pie. And I have the Monster Cookie. And they're sealed in two different ways. So mine has a seal underneath. That has a plastic. Kevin has a plastic thing. I wonder I'm if you have a seal underneath too. Probably not. Probably not. Nope. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing they're main, maybe they're packaged in two different machines maybe. I don't know, but I'm just saying, you just saw, there's, there's two ways of doing this. Either it's under the cap or it's around the outside. Yeah. I'd rather go around the outside. Like so crisps. Yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> Um, but uh, I'd rather do that because I can see it, but uh, trust me, I didn't think anything about looking under there in the store too to make well, sure. Well, you can feel the whole edge of yeah. the, the thing. But if they can do it, all companies can do it. Yeah. So just so they you know. They choose not to. They choose not to. Mary and Berry Pie. Uh, made, with, like made with extra cream, rich vanilla ice cream with pie crust pieces and ripe Oregon Marion berries. Uh, let's see. Uh, they are distributed by Tillamook Creamery, Tillamook, made in the USA. Uh, nine servings, two thirds cup, 95 grams is 210 calories. And they're made in Oregon in 1909, it says. So, and these are, are pretty soft. I haven't had this sitting out. Which is probably a good thing. It yeah. means something. <laughs> okay. Ooh, wow, look it at means that it's really. easier for me. Yeah. That's what it means. Look at that swirl on there. It looks nice. I'm going to eat out of the tub because we keep these. Yeah, we keep the ice cream. We don't give the ice cream away. Not generally. <laughs> mm. That like, is very like sweet. Berries. Yes, um, that's very sweet. Because this kind of reminds me of blackberries, raspberries, that kind of thing. They look like it. This has a sweeter, not quite as punchy uh, flavor. It's very uh, fruity kind of flavor. I wonder if Marion berries grow, because you know I didn't look it up before the video. No. Do they grow in Oregon? It said, I thought it said Oregon's Marion berries. Did it say Oregon Marion berries? You read something about them. I did, but yeah, yeah, I did say Oregon Marion berries. That's what I thought. I know I read that, but then it's like, do they, I guess that's where they grow. Yeah, that's where uh, they come from. Okay. <laughs> I like the I like those berries better than raspberry and blackberries though, because they're not as punchy. Like raspberries have a really like a sharpness to them. Blackberries are, are sometimes a little bitter. This is very sweet, just like a fresh berry flavor. Kind of like a strawberry is a very sweet berry flavor. This is kind of like that. What is the one that we had that grows in California that we? I know what you're talking about. We took us forever to find a can of it. <coughs> mm -hmm. Boys and berry. Boys and berry. Boys and berries. Boys and berries. I like these better. Yes. Okay. Um, I do too. I like this more than boys and berry. So why? Ooh, look at this swirl right here. Look at that really deep, dark red. If these, okay. So I know I read Oregon Marion berry, but so you think the berries grow in? Oregon, so you would think that they would have a whole festival. Probably do. They probably do have a whole festival, and we've never heard of it. No, there's lots of festivals we've never heard of. And it's we, really, really good. Do we? We don't get those. Mm -mm. No. Tell you what, I wish we got this ice cream down here, though, because it's really. Good. I know. I, I don't understand why would Tillamook deliver? We get the same ice creams all the time, and we don't ever get anything new. And I think a lot of that sometimes comes um, down to the store. Whoever's like the manager oh, yeah. of the frozen section, they get used to just checking off the same thing on the order sheets. And so we get in the same stuff. We never get anything new. Mm -hmm. People would love this. It's that, delicious. It's sweet. It almost has like a, now I've eaten a ton of it, 
it almost has a honey flavor. The ushroom itself does. Mm -hmm. It's almost like it leaves a little bit of a honey flavor in your mouth. It's really good. Uh, I, I won't even mention, like, it says pie pieces. I don't even know the pie pieces are in there. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> and that's the only thing I would count them off on with that is there should have been pie pieces. Well, it says pie pieces, but um, you just don't take, which is probably a good thing. I'd rather not be able to even notice they're there at all than this kind of mushy, soggy. the mushy crust yeah. texture that it's like, ew, I don't like that. No, I so, agree. You don't, definitely don't want soggy right. pie pieces. So I just assume not have it at all. I mean, not be able to detect it at all. Then right, detect it just badly. leave them out. <laughs> it doesn't need it, clearly. It doesn't need it at all. And the ice cream itself is so creamy and smooth. It's just really good. I've had people forever tell me to try this. Mont Monster cookie don't and I'm like don't where is this monster yeah, cookie and why don't we get it yeah. there's no good reason that you can give me why we I, don't get I it I do have to say that most of the Tillamook sections in our grocery store is very small it's like one little row like a one little line yeah. that's it. it you maybe get like five or six flavors and we don't get a huge selection yeah, but there's no reason not to get there's this. Not a reason. Uh, monster cookie is rich cookie dough ice cream with a salted Peanut buttery yeah. swirl, yeah, peanut butter. crispy oats, chocolatey flakes, and sweet candies. Wow, I had not read this clearly. I'm Monster excited. Monster cookie is oats, peanut butter, and I wasn't M &M thinking pieces. about the peanut butter though. Yeah. I, the peanut butter, I was thinking oats. I had forgotten about the peanut mm -hmm. butter. Uh, two thirds cup, 95 grams, is 240 calories. That's and more than the, Kevin opened this already. More than the um, the berries. You know, one thing I too about, about uh, stuff, getting stuff in at stores, you also have to consider if stores have their own store brand, they tend to take up a lot of space with their store brands. Uh, that's true. Like, um, like uh, Kroger, Kroger probably half of their ice cream section is the Kroger brand. And we won't buy it because it's not sales. Uh, Walmart, they're getting bigger and bigger on their Walmart Yeah, brands. they are. It's funny though, Kroger can do that all they want, but we won't buy them until they start selling them. And I get people they're using to make it. I get people that recommend the private selection Kroger all the time and I won't buy it. Mm, look at that big peanut butter mm -hmm. swirl on there. There's nothing better than a, a thick frozen piece of peanut butter mm -hmm. in ice cream. And this is what this is. I wonder what would happen if you put the whole jar of Jif in the freezer. I wonder if anybody actually does that. Or take it out of the bowl and put it in a container. I don't know. It, would, it wouldn't hurt it. To I wouldn't be it. able to eat it though. You know, oh, you don't think you'd be able to container? get it out of there? Yeah. Because this is frozen pretty That's farmer. delicious peanut butter. It is very, very good peanut butter. It's I haven't got any oatmeal though. perfectly salty but sweet peanut mm -hmm. butter. It's very cold. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, see, I got chocolate. I've gotten chocolate and I've gotten peanut butter and of course the ice cream, but I haven't got any oats. Did it say it had oats in it? I don't remember if I, re I, well, I read peanut butter and then my mind could just kind of <laughs> lost it. Peanut butter and candies. That's what I remember. <laughs> peanut butter swirl. It says crispy oats, chocolatey flakes, and sweet candies. I haven't gotten any oats. I've gotten peanut yeah, butter. Either. I've gotten the little candies. Like here's one right here. It's mm -hmm. green. I've got tons of peanut butter, but I haven't seen any, I haven't seen any oats in here. Mm -mm. Which might be a, just like the poppies, it might be a good thing. Yeah, but I, I absolutely, I would think that they use just peanut butter. Mm-hmm. No way. I got a little hunk of oats. Mm. It wasn't crispy though. Mm, let's go. Yeah, to me that tastes like just peanut butter. What you're it's, saying a it's lot. very sweet and it's salty. perfect yeah. yes it's perfect I, I love the peanut butter um and that's mainly what i'm getting from that um got a, one little candy piece in my bowl but i could just eat like huge <laughs> just dig all the peanut the, butter the peanut out. butter with <laughs> the and the, the ice cream itself is absolutely delicious that seems very good too very, it's super, super creamy. Mm -hmm. Yes, it, it's a wonderful ice cream. And it is actually melting. Right? We've reviewed, yes, it, it does melt. Mm -hmm. uh, we've reviewed a lot of Tillamook on the channel. Mm -hmm. I do know that they have a new chocolate collection out. I haven't seen it either. I was also told that Publix has an, an exclusive flavor. And so I would like to get my hands on that. I just have to travel to a Publix to get it. Um, we don't have one really close. No. Maybe in the next year or so. Yeah, we, yes. 
Uh, so hopefully I'm able to get that. Uh, but I'll, I will be looking out for the chocolate collection and everything. But these, uh, if anybody from Tillamook is watching, there's no reason why we shouldn't have these in Central Kentucky. Kentuckians would love this. Like, stuff. like you said, I don't think it's the Tillamook company. I think it's the, the store people ordering. ordering. Yeah, it, it's funny though. I had uh, I posted a picture to Instagram of these, and someone else has told me. They've also been looking for that Mary and Berry flavor for a while, and they cannot find it either. And they are in Ohio. <laughs> hey, so, there you go. I know. They'll have to travel about an hour to get there because they're far away from Jungle Gems. But still, yes, at least now you know you can go there and get it. Um, if you only had to pick one. Probably it's the, hard. Probably the Monster. It's so different because one's very berry fruity kind of flavor mm. and then one's very like peanut butter forward yes with chocolate yes. but both of them are like top both notch. of them are excellent but if, but if i only could choose one to eat regularly probably the monster probably the monster just because we both love peanut butter yeah but there's absolutely nothing wrong with this no beer. it's sweet and delicious mm -hmm. so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching